All right, let's get to the connection sphere. Hello? Hey! Is she over at, uh, EAS-11? Yeah, she is. Okay. Hold on, I will put a waypoint on there and see if that will help me navigate to it. Hey, nice! God, that would help me. That would help me so much earlier. I need 3D positioning at times, you know? Okay, Emma. I'm here. Uh, I guess I'll... <laughs> I'll mess with these again. Alright, let's go see what Josh has been up to. I think he's gonna have a vendetta against me, because we technically blast him out into space. And... This is only my second time outside the station. Oh, really? And now I have two stations. Well, at least Come you have me. Jumping off into the deep end. Or am I just gonna, like, float alongside her? I totally think it'd be a good idea to, like, grab... Grab okay. the sphere and use it to steer us. That's us tethered together for the jump. Yeah, see? That's something. If I start to drift, you can try to course correct in the sphere. Exactly. I'm not sure the science is spot on, but it's better than nothing. You can be my anchor. I don't know if we're actually going to okay. legitimately help her out in this process, but I'll Here try. Goes. It could just be a, a big cutscene. Oh my god, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh god. Still with me, Sam? Whoa! Hey! 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 What's up? This rescue ship is identical. They must have built a secondary station. Like a prototype, maybe. Why would they need two stations? Okay, okay, we're almost there. Okay, shit, Sam, you're drifting. Well, I can't control anything Did currently. Ow. Yeah, I would love to course correct, but I can't. It's a cutscene. Okay, be careful. You're gonna hit that module. Seriously, I have no control. Please, 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 please. Got it. Got it. I'm on Sam. Oh god, I never want to do that again. Be careful. I'm a floating sphere. I'll be fine. As long as the game actually gives me control. I don't know what's going on with Sam. Anyways, this is totally just another observation space station. Like, like no... No other thing can be said except for this is totally a duplicated space station okay, because sorry. space shenanigans. Let me get your light on. Looks like this module isn't used much. This is crazy. It's the exact same design. I thought they reused sections of existing stations for observation. There's no power by the looks of things. Guess you will be my light, Sam. I think I'd prefer you up front anyway. Straight ahead, then. Nice and slow. Oh god, am I actually gonna, like, fly us around? Alright. Is she gonna stay behind me, or...? Okay. So we're totally in another version of observation, except maybe this one only had Sam in it, and Strange. he didn't know what to do. My suit is showing ammonia in the air. I'm gonna keep my helmet on until we get out of these modules. These hatches are not connected to my system links. Of course, sorry. Just hang on, I'll try to budge them. Yep. I don't have hands, Emma. Please understand. Excuse there me. Let's keep going. To UN3. This is so weird. It's identical. So much for us being a flagship. 
The hatch ahead is open. We can access Universal. Josh, do you read me? Where are you? We're here. We're in the same fucking space station. We're gonna find, like, May. Oh shit, I left her behind. Emma! Hey! I'm a little spooked too. Look, if there's a duplicated space station, there's a chance there's a duplicated Sam. And I don't know what two Sams are gonna be like. Ow. Hold on, we got another laptop here. Message to Chris, um, Hi, everyone. I know a lot of you have been getting head up about requests from Houston and from me that have been butting into your work this past week. I just wanted to see that you all have a role to play here, and getting frustrated isn't helping anyone. Frustration leads to mistakes, nothing more. As you know, some aspects of every mission are above your pay grade, and you know I can't divulge anything more than that. Keep focused on the task in hand, please. Oh, that's almost a similar message to the one that we heard beforehand, but not exactly. Oh boy. Oh boy. So not only is it a duplicate space station, it's alternative people in general. There are signs of injury to the station crew. Really? Oh my god. Is that... Oh god. What? It's just a helmet. It's a fucking empty helmet. <laughs> it's a sign of a, a floating helmet. That's- that's what I've got here. Can I report that laptop? Cause I really want to, I really want to just be like, uh, Emma. This message is somewhat similar to ones that we have listened to in the past. Here are some... It looks like this is an oxygen tank. This place might have ran out of oxygen. But I just don't know. Here's another laptop. Hmm. Don't have the code for this. Maybe. Look around. There could be a code in the room. Yep. One nine four two. Okay. I was hoping I was like, or it could be one of the the codes we've already accessed. One, nine, four, two. with these people. But I'm looking around. Uh, that was the dead end. There's got to be an open door or something around here. Hey, Saturn. Could you not be shining that bright-ass light up here? Jeez. Okay. I like when you go into response mode, you can kind of, like, pulse out. But that makes me think that we're going to be able to, like, use this to scan. There are signs of injury to the station crew. What would you like me to do, Emma? I said go forward, Sam, but stay close. No, I'm looking around. You're going to have to open doors for me, I think. Because I don't have access to really anything besides random laptops. Also, she's like, stay close to me, but uh... I have no connection to the UN3 ULB hatch. Emma, I require your assistance. Yeah, she's been staying back. I guess we technically do pulse out and like can highlight big objects. I just haven't been noticing it because we don't really have objects like this size. Uh, it's 
Well, I don't know what to do about it. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I ain't got hands, Emma. Just give me a sec. Dead buddy on the other side? No. Well, that's a positive. That's a plus. That's something you can look forward to. Oh, there's the goop. Is it from an alien? Or it almost just reminds me of like, just like blood. Just blood floating around. Ah, God. Jeez, Emma, what happened to me going forward? Get out of my way. Hello? Uh, keep moving, Sam. Okay, what is this? Well, yeah, this place is creepy as shit. What's that laptop, Sam? Which one? This one over here? This is a laptop belonging to Dr. Emma Fisher. Oh, shit. It's not mine, Sam. Get it here. There's a message. I mean, I already this is another station. This is. It's our station. Observation. Shit. Oh. The light. You and six, come on. Wait, maybe that's just another Sam. Oh God, please don't put us into a horror situation. I mean, this is a horror situation. <laughs> really bad situation in general. But I mean, like, if she gets killed by another version of me, whew, Josh. don't know what to say about that. She's seeing, okay? I'm I'm much slower than her. I propulse myself with CO2, okay? Uh, it's not the same. Oh, what the hell? He's getting away, Sam, keep up! You know, these people might be hostile. They could be crazy. There's a May that's alive. I wonder if that's gonna be who we run into. May, you're alive, but you just floated off into deep space. Oh boy, this is fucked. You know, Emma, you said you watched. Oh my God, Sam, it's Jim, not Josh. Movie? What? Fuck. Oh, it's the same Jim. Fuck. Okay. Can you hear me? Oh, what am I saying? He's dead. We saw him. Is this gym gonna be alive? That'd be that'd be neat. Oh god! His eyes are open. Okay, I definitely think he's dead. You want you to do be in your hand? Okay, <laughs> like I tried doing that before. His eyes closed and then he's actually still alive. I'm here. I'm here. No, you can't be. How did you get back here? But what do you mean, back here? Well, I saw you go in an airlock with no suit on. You can't be here. Why would I go out the airlock without a suit? Because he opened the fucking door on you. 
Hey, it wasn't me. It was a different Sam. <laughs> oh, hold on now. Guys, this is clearly your, your scientists or something on a space station. You gotta know your science fiction. Hey, stop. Okay, take it slow. You pretty much out of oxygen. No gulps, okay? What's happening? How long has it been since we ended up here? A few hours, give or take. I'm not sure. I don't understand what's happening. Hey, Jim. We're not in Earth orbit. We're, uh, We're in the orbit of Saturn. I know. I know. We spoke about it just after it happened. Jim. This is the first time I've seen you since it happened. I got a message from Josh not long ago. That's why I'm here. Where is he? I don't know. I've been running around trying to find something to repair this suit. There's a tear in it. We need to pressurize this module, Emma, or I am a dead man. What about the hatches? There's no power on the way here. There's a tiny bit of power from the panels. We can direct it to one or two hatches at a time, but not them all. Okay. Let's get the pressure fixed, and then we find Josh. Emma, forget Josh. You didn't push me out of the airlock. I'm here. I'm fine. Whoa. He killed Ilsa. I saw it myself. She just would never do that. To Ilsa, to me, or anyone. I know, but he's not himself. He's dangerous. Emma, he says he can see noise and words in his vision. He keeps saying, bring her over and over again. He's fucking lost it. Okay. Okay. Sam. Go look for Josh. I'll wait here with Jim until we get pressurized. Yeah, yeah, all right. You chill with, uh, all right, goodbye. She's leaving the space station. Well, fuck you guys. She cl straight closed the hatch on me. Yeah, station white blackout, and then here we are. Sam didn't come back online. We managed to get through some of the hatch doors to meet Central. We got the EFR online. <laughs> we couldn't get ours running. Never worked. Nothing works. This place is a tomb. Yeah, I see that. Could I get their EFR we'll working? We'll redirect the power to the hatches on your command, Sam. Do a sweep of the modules. Josh might be hurt. Search Russian arm for Josh. Search Universal for Josh. Search EAS for Josh. Okay, so this is a station that ported over where Josh is the one who's probably getting everything communicated to him. Or something along those lines, maybe. I want to find out more. Station functionality review. Summary. I have performed the first station functionality review as scheduled. Now that the mission has been active for one full calendar month. I must be candid here. I believe the committee would be disappointed with these results if they weren't already aware. I've liaised, or I've liaised with the crew prior to launch and again since, and the general consensus is that the station does not have the required equipment and functions required for allocated missions. The expectations were that this was a flagship station with state-of-the-art hardware, but what we're seeing in the new sections of the ship is very bare. The universal ring is barely functional beyond providing access. These rooms are lacking in equipment, and its clear corners have been cut. I would ask RCSA to liaise with the committee, EASA and CASA, in order to better understand why the station is so poorly equipped compared to the spec we had trained for. Are we expecting additional equipment to be shipped up after an undisclosed delay? If not, then either we're, we've been badly or uh, then either we've been badly let down by our friends in the committee, or that they want to keep the cost of this mission as low as possible. I'm happy to go on the record with these statements, as the facts contained within this review are sufficient evidence to the claim. Stanislav Lenov, Observation Technical Officer. So this is a space station, or this is an observation that was <laughs> that was given the low budget treatment, and now they're suffering even more than our observation because our observation was suited enough to at least be able to have the EFR. What are we gonna do about this? God, this is things have gotten Hatch crazy. RU six is offline. Yeah, I know, Sam. I can't open it while we're repressurizing. Jim needs to put on a fresh suit. Go look for Josh. Okay, all right. We're looking for different things. Do I have my map? No. Uh, I don't remember the layout of the Russian... the Russian arm. I'll just have to float around until something works. This is glowing. Or it was, from a distance. We might have to use it in the future. Have I used this laptop? I definitely haven't. Message to Houston, Sam. Sam? Shit. Houston, I don't know you, Sam. 
FM is broadcasting, but we have problems here. Serious problems. You have to make contact ASAP. I saw Jim heading to RU6 in a hurry and lock himself in. Is he trying to leave? He pushed me out of the way. I've never seen him like that. Uh, Alright, he's in RU6. Or possibly in RU6. We're just gonna keep looking around. Emma, please repeat your instruction. I said do a sweep of the modules. Search the area and look for Josh. He must be here somewhere. Alright, I'm just gonna keep on looking around and at some point he's probably gonna show up and do something crazy. Maybe. I'm just kind of trying to go backwards. This is RE6. We went we did go backwards, shit. Okay. I actually wanna leave at the same time. But I go so slow, and I don't have a map. And space is disorienting. We'll try this way. <sighs> so, I'm interested to find out why this is. I was worried that maybe we were going to be dealing with a situation having, like, time travel or something, but it's worse! This is straight up, the, the space station got duplicated. Message for whoever gets it. I'm heading to UC1 to get the comms open if I can. With no Sam, it's difficult, though. Has anyone seen Jim? Anyone seen Jim? Damn it, I just want to get everything working. Uh Well, we're probably going to be following breadcrumbs through here. Hello. Uh, calibration log. Josh Ramen. Test calibration mode set to active. Damage to circuits. Unable to schedule module. Separation. Launch settings updated by Josh Ramen. System lockout in effect. Oh boy. Oh, Joshy. I wonder if we're going to end up going back and forth between the two stations. That would be a mindfuck. Maybe we'll find... Maybe we'll find Stav here. Or Staz. Maybe he'll be alive this time. Although, things are pretty fucked. We're gonna... This is gonna end up in a situation... Patch RU1 has been recently closed. It might have something to do with the power being redirected to RU6. Or it could be something else. Be careful. Huh. <laughs> I don't like the sounds of that shit closing. Anyways, this might be a scenario where, like, there are gonna be a bunch of observation space station alternatives out there, and we get, like, one person from each. Message to Josh, Sam. Josh? Are you there? The hull is secure, and oxygen candles burning. We're building up humidity, and that's gonna take its toll, though. Try to stay cool. I'm heading to UC2 to see if I can get Sam back online. We need him to work out what just happened. I'm partially confused just because I'm pretty sure the captain just said that, one, we killed Emma, or a different version of Sam killed Emma, and two, they didn't get Sam online, or Sam's not working right now. So, uh, mixed, mixed information. But I'm working with what we've got. Hello. This is what I'm looking for. Did you hear the noise too? We did. A few times actually. And each time things got worse and worse. What do you mean? Josh. He said they were signals that only he could see them. But that they weren't meant for him. I'm telling you, he's dangerous. Look, Emma's gonna be biased because there was clearly some kind of romance going on. I don't know if our Emma and him were like full, like, like she's the Emma in this one just straight up said I love you, you right? So I mean, that, there's that, but we don't know the if that's the same level here. In which case, oh boy, oh, that that'll be dramatic. But for the sake of simplicity, we'll just say that she was probably together with the Josh on our space station too, which is why she was so worried and relieved when when we figured that hey maybe he's alive. The hatch to UC2 is offline. Wait, 
You can't let him in there. That's his mainframe. It's not my Sam's mainframe. Doesn't matter. It's a bad idea, seriously. Okay, opening now, Sam. Ha! Ah! Oh, fuck's sake. <gasps> Thank you. It would be a good idea to get this whole place up and running. Now, what's with this laptop? Oh, is this the one from before? Yeah, okay, it's the one from Emma. Well, dead Emma. Stay away from the mainframe. It's not functioning. It's too risky to turn it on. Maybe we can learn something from it. Yeah, maybe we can learn a lot from Mother Sam. Whoa, shit, dead person. Emma. You have sustained fatal injuries. My condolences. Sam, I can't hear a word you're saying. I'll be with you soon. We found Emma. We found Emma. And she doesn't even know that we found her. Oh, God. Emma, you shouldn't go in here. Is she actually coming here right now? Or am I still just looking around? I think we're still just looking around, but we got the power terminal on. I don't know what that's gonna do, but it helps out everywhere else, maybe. Emma, please. Let's try and get to the other arms. Which one is this one? This one leads to the Russian arm. Not trying to go there. Trying to go to the universal arm. And the EAS arm. That's the Chinese arm. This is the EAS, which I can't access. Everything's down, damn it. I don't know what turning on the power did. I want to look around there a little bit more just because the captain was so worried that I would connect with the mainframe and shit would go down. And I'm really, really down for it. There, interfacing with other Sam. What would you like to know? Everything. What is your Sam online status? I am here. Okay, he's online. He's around. What is your system status? All core functions are disabled. There is insufficient power to enable service. Uh, yeah, yeah, that would make sense. What is your primary mission status? Deep life and official disease. Alfie Young, deceased. Stanislav Leonov, deceased. Josh Ramon, May Morgan, deceased. Jesus, I'm mission status is inactive. Previous mission logs are now available. Display. Authentication required. Precursor 1. Precursor 1. Access granted. Nice. We've got his memory core. Okay. What do we have? Sam mission status, precursor one detail. Are those all I can click on? I want precursor details. What is precursor one? Precursor one. Mission director William Stafford. Program Captain Jim Elias. Low orbit space station, install SAM, AI agent responsible for discovery. Reach event marker, observe. What is? What is that? What is SAM's role? Initial discovery of three patterns in the standard Kepler data set. Okay, so. The Sam AI observed some kind of fucking thing going on, 
Aliens! Aliens, okay? That's what it is. It's just straight up aliens. What is pattern one? There are 23 pairs of identical transit light curves from different stars within our galaxy. This is statistically impossible. Each pair linked showed converging connecting vector lines at one point in space, hereby known as the event marker. Close to Earth's position, approximately four years from signal discovery. This pattern was labeled where and when. Oh boy, we're getting big information reveals from this guy. Thanks, me. What is pattern two? On inspection of the 46 light curves discovered in pattern one, each transit graph contained a spike. This occurred at exactly the same point in time for each. This was labeled sync point. When, where, sync point? Okay. What about pattern three? Did we just straight up get a message? What is pattern three? Overlaying each of these light curves on the same point creates a new pattern of sequential light curve troughs. There was deeper detail in the light curves themselves. When analyzed, they show a perfect description of the human genome. Oh shit. Each of the 23 pairs of identical patterns shows each chromosome in mankind's DNA code. This was labeled who? So, the reason this project's called Precursor is because we're assuming that these may have been either aliens that are super advanced and therefore we just call them Precursors, or we call them Precursors because maybe they're us. Super advanced us, I don't know. What was the crew mission? There was no active crew mission. They were just... They were, they were just here? They were just bodies? What was the captain's mission? Precursor 1 had one objective. Approach event marker at where and when, with who, and observe. Bring her? Structural integrity failing. Power levels insufficient. 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 Well, first we need to continue looking around for Josh, because he's still alive. Oh, look, this is open now. Lovely. All right. Aliens. That's like the summary of everything here. Aliens. What the fuck's going on? Aliens. 